California State women's basketball made their home debut and improved to 2-1 on the season with an 80-56 win over the Newman Jets on Thursday night. Emporia State's first lead of the game came at the 5-18 mark of the first quarter on this Carson Schultz bucket. Carson Schultz stick back is good. And they never looked back, taking a 42-23 lead into the halftime break. And Treasure takes it to the rim, lays it up and in, and that'll bring it in to the first half of basketball. I mean, this is our home court. Like, nobody's going to come in and take that from us. Like, Coach always says, protect the tradition, protect our home court, and do whatever it takes. The Lady Hornets shot an impressive 46.9% from three-point land for the game and held Newman to just 35.6% shooting from the field. Emporia State was led in scoring by point guard Treasure Joe with 22 points. Treasure, left wing three, bingo! Carson Schultz had a big night for the Lady Hornets with 16 points and nine boards. Here's a three, she knocks it home. I had a really bad practice yesterday, so today I just came in and cleared my mind and just shot like I normally can. While Callie Martin was right behind her with 15 points on five of six shooting from behind the arc. Kicks it out to Callie. Thought about the three. Now she'll let the defense fly by. Shoots the three as the buzzer goes up. Interim head coach Kyle Unruh took over for Toby Wynn, who is currently in isolation. Honestly, I'm really happy with our performance. Uh, we had a, a good week of practice. Uh, the girls did a really good job of, of executing the game plan. Uh, and Coach Wynn, unfortunately, wasn't being able to be here, uh, but he was still heavily involved. Uh, so he's able to watch practice, we're still able to talk, communicate, Zoom, all that stuff, and, and be able to come up with a good game plan. And then our players just went out and executed. And I think he was so nervous. Like, yeah. before the game, he was like, I haven't slept in three days. <laughs> like, I gotta come out and win. I'm definitely glad we stepped up for him and kind of took the nerves down, because he still got, I mean, we got Saturday's game in like a whole another week. So, I mean, I think he's a little bit more relaxed. Yeah. He prepared himself, though. Yeah, he definitely yeah. The Lady Hornets will be back in action on Saturday at 3 o'clock versus Central Oklahoma. You can catch all of the action on KFFX Radio and the MIAA Network.com. And as always, Stingers up!